This time around, we want to have one loop as the background. We then want to fade in text, fade in a pip simultaneously, and then both the text and the pip should move from the left to the right. So, first of all, we grab a clip which we will use as a background. We'll move it to the timeline, get the opacity up and select play loop. Then we select layer 2. We'll choose a second clip which will be our PIP, picture in picture. And once we've done that, we'll also get the opacity up and select play loop. Now we scale and position the PIP right outside the background's left side and there we'll store the position to the timeline. After we've done that, we will move the pip to the right side and repeat the same process. Store active. And once we've done that, we will take care of our text input. We'll go to our project folder where we can right click and select add text input which appears just like content in the project tree. And once we hit apply, we can select the text and put it onto the layer we selected, in this case, layer number three. Get the opacity up so that we can see it, and there it is. Just like with the pip, we'll scale the text and we'll position it. Once it's reached the position we want, we follow that with a store active to save the position onto the timeline. Let's now move it to the end position. Once more, store active. And then, let's just jump back to the beginning and take a look at what we've done. 